mesdames et messieurs, damas y caballeros. Today we have an exceptional fossil that is so deeply oil soft. It is covering me head to toe. And it tastes like chocolate. Uh, we, we have a very special award and we will begin on a slightly more normal note. But at the end, do stick around because there will be a surprise of the type that I have never witnessed in all of the four days I've been giving this fossil award. So, on, but we, we must first step back from the process a little bit. And before we go rushing into giving away the fossil award, we, we really should investigate, should we discuss giving the fossil award? But, but before that, because we can't rush into that either, we should, but first we should discuss whether or not we can investigate discussing giving out the fossil award. Because, because here, here, here in the maritime, we, we don't want to rush into things or, or do things. Um, so that's why we have developed the IFCDFDF, the Interfederational uh, Campesinos uh, Delivery Fossil Department Committee, um, to help us deliver today's fossil. Um, but first, we've come up with a, a series of documents describing why we can't actually begin to discuss giving the fossil yet. So the, the first one in point A, section 2, paragraph B, is that we, we just do not have the capacity to give a fossil award. Um, and then, as we can see in paragraph 14, section B, underline bracket 2, um, we, we really don't know the impacts of giving a fossil award. And, and we, we really can't investigate that because we don't know the imp impacts of giving that award either. Um, and then, as we all know in paragraph 6, section T, <laughs> um, it might just be too hard to give a fossil award, so, so we really shouldn't try because we, we don't want to fail. Um, and then, the, um, on a more economic sense, um, we really cannot, cannot give out one of these precious, precious, precious fossil awards uh, because it could substantially um, impact our ability to export things such as tomatoes, rice, <laughs> oil, um, and coal. Um, just standard things that we all export uh, sometimes. Um, finally, as you might be noticing already, Perhaps giving out the fossil, or in thinking about giving out, or investigating giving out the fossil, is just a waste of time. Um, and lastly, we really don't need to give out the fossil, or think about possibly investigating giving out the fossil, because you can all just look it up on Google, and, and that, that will really tell us everything we need to know. That is right, ladies and gentlemen. You may have had an inkling of where this is headed. Today's fossil goes not, not just to one outstanding country, not just to two, but a series of four countries that have put their combined effort so uh, soakingly deep, entrenchingly slippery into the process that um, they have received today's gigantic fossil of the day. Whoa, whoa, what's this? But this is just a representative of today's winner of the fossil of the day is really the coagulation of Oman, Saudi Arabia, Kuwait, and Qatar. And they have won this for Talk <laughs> Favorite, favorite, favorite. Okay, uh... No, where's the... <laughs> Great! Hey, hey! Round of applause for, um... That, that was actually intentional. We just wanted to delay the process a little more. <laughs> um, that is right, ladies and gentlemen. The first place fossil collected... Oh, it's slippery. I told you about the light. First place fossil was collectively awarded to Kuwait, Oman, Saudi Arabia, and Qatar for risking the good faith and integrity of the negotiations by blocking all attempts to secure a technical review of the 1.5 degree target and suggesting that vulnerable countries use Google to get the information that they need. They did this in the teeth of emotional pleas 
from vulnerable countries and numerous rounds of diplomatic efforts to reach a compromise. Saudi Arabia even gave us a list of traded goods which would be in peril if a 1.5 degrees target was met. See if you can spot the one that is the true concern. Rice? Coca? Tomatoes? Coal? Oil? If you're stuck, just look up their chief export on Google and that might help you figure it out. Thank you very much ladies and gentlemen, but do not go anywhere. Because as I mentioned before, today is not, not, not an ordinary fossil. This, today, the next fossil is, a, is an honorary fossil. Normally fossils are only given to countries, um, or groups of countries, or conglomerations of letters that represent various countries. Um, but today, we have an honorary fossil to give to a certain uh, group that really goes beyond expectations. It goes beyond the expected. It goes beyond possibilities. It really goes beyond anything expected. Who could that be? Whoa! That is right, ladies and gentlemen. In an unprecedented act, BP USA is awarded an honorary fossil from Penn. Um, Pan International for fostering our addiction to fossil fuels, an addiction that is driving global warming towards dangerous climate change and lies behind the disaster unfolding in the Gulf of Mexico. The consequences of foregoing a global agreement to move off fossil fuels and invest in a low carbon future are clear. Scientists have run the numbers. Unless warming is checked, temperatures will increase way beyond the threshold of catastrophic climate change. For some countries, the toll is already mounting as negotiations begin here in Bonn, hundreds have died in India and Pakistan during the hottest heat wave on record, with temperatures shooting over 50 degrees Celsius. This is bitterly ironic, given that we have opportunities. Each year we delay, we pass by opportunities to invest in clean energy. The International Energy Agency has calculated the cost of passing, the cost of passing by those opportunities at 500 billion a year. At the same time, 100 billion a year in subsidies are paid to fossil fuel companies worldwide. 100 billion in subsidies to fossil fuel companies. Checking climate change and sustaining economic growth depend upon an international agreement to invest in clean energy. BP USA, a leader in fossil fuel development that has played out so disastrously in the Gulf of Mexico, is awarded an honorary fossil for failing to fulfill its responsibility to help break the fossil fuel addiction it has fostered and address climate change. Would BP please come and accept this award? I mean, now, be careful, uh, you don't want it to spill. Yeah, careful now, careful now. If that spills, uh, we don't know what will happen because we didn't do a proper report. Oh, and don't forget, um, you also get a gift certificate for 100 billion from, um, in subsidies. To, to go along with your work. Thank you very much. Um, a big boo for BP. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. This has been the presentation of the Fossil Today Award presented by Cannes International and finally a rousing song by our beautiful chorus. On de toi!